Hey guys, subscribe for daily content. And if you're shopping for gear, make sure you check out the description for the newest items at some of the very best online retailers. There's also links for some of the items that I personally recommend. Thanks. Hey, I got it. <laughs> What's going on YouTube? Metal Complex here. And today I've got another short little unboxing to share with you guys. Obviously narrow packages, it's hard to throw the card and make it stick. Uh, I have no idea what's in here. Likely somebody sending something uh, as a response to my recent community post about knives that I'm looking for for review. So thank you for doing that. I'm actually still looking for a lot of knives. So if you don't mind loaning out your knives, uh, knife or knives for a few weeks, uh, check out that community uh, post in my community tab. Read through some of the guidelines and things like that. But yeah, uh, there are definitely knives that I'm still looking for for review, so I would appreciate that. Thanks so much to my generous patrons who are supporting me right now. There's a link for Patreon right down below. And please make sure to follow me on Instagram at metal underscore complex. This package was sent by... Where... Oh, I covered it. Hang on. I gotta peel this back. So the reason that there's that little label right there is because there was shipping information. Can I see through it? Oh, gosh bless it. I bet you there's a note in there. There we go. This was sent by Russell. Thank you very much, Russell. Let's find out what's inside this package. I'm going to have to move off camera and make a quick cut real quick. I'm definitely not cutting towards myself. Just trust me. I would never do that. <laughs> don't cut towards yourself. Don't cut towards yourself. Okay. We have uh, an artisan. Oh, wait. Oh, Russell. Oh, my gosh. Russell! I'm sorry. I keep forgetting you're the rep. <laughs> Russell's the rep for Artisan Calorie CJRB. Okay. I was like, there's no note. It's Russell. Okay. So the CJRB, what do we have here? Oh. Oh, oh, yes. I do remember now. Look at these interesting, this interesting scale color. We have like a magenta. Yeah. Yeah, all right. So that's a really good, straightforward design. What do we have here? AR RPM 9. Oh, yeah. Okay. Kind of gives me, not not copy, right? People go, people are so quick to go, copy! Cancel up. No, calm down. Calm yourself. Not a copy of like an ode to the Hinder XM18 in a slight, just a, just a little bit, right? But cool. Definitely. Nice full size knife, full four finger grip, nice choke up position, and a nice drop point blade, right? Good thumb studs. I bet you can get after those and do the reverse flick. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Flipping action is also good. Yeah. In any case, you'll be able to go down into the description and check it out. I believe that's a titanium pocket clip. These are my Carter scales that have been dyed coral or magenta, whatever you want to call it. Where's my magnet? There it is. Okay, it's wanting to grab the steel liners. The pocket clip, I think is titanium because I think it's wanting to grab the liners underneath, which by the way, there are countersunk liners. That's a nice design, straightforward. AR RPM 9 being, uh, to my knowledge, the only powder formed true budget steel in existence, right? Consistent budget steel. This is essentially powder form 9CR 18 MOV, which is a good steel in ingot form. Um, okay, I like this one. It's nice to see something new from Artisan Cutlery. I'm sorry, CJRB, who is, uh, you know, the, essentially the, they're, it's the same as Artisan Cutlery, it's just the budget, um, the less expensive territory. Artisan Cutlery, what do we have here? I have no idea. I don't remember at all, but I know that I requested two knives. What are we taking away? Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. One with a big pivot. Yeah, okay. Sort of a claw shaped blade. We have here for the seal also AR RPM knife. I'm going to guess that this is also not an expensive knife. Generally, what we see is ours and Cutlery does the more expensive stuff. CGR, CGRB does the less expensive stuff. But I'm going to guess that these two are probably somewhat close in price. I mean, it's the same idea. We've got the JG10, big pivot color pivot, right? AR RPM 9 and what looks to be a titanium. Well, some iridescence going on there. Look at there. Purple, blue, purple, blue, right? I think at least this one's available. Perhaps both. In any case, I will link them or I'll link coming soon pages to them. These are interesting. It's always fun to look at new stuff. So I appreciate that. Obviously, this was not sent as a result of my knives looking for review. Rather, just a conversation with CJRB 
uh, slash artisan cutlery. So I appreciate that. As per usual, this is not a review. It's just an unboxing and first impressions, which means two to three weeks from now, you guys will get individual, full, comprehensive reviews for each of these knives. 15 to 20 minutes, right? Just need some time to gather my thoughts and kind of uh, put, put everything together in a, a comprehensive review. In any case, I do appreciate... Uh, Russell, I appreciate you sending these in for review, Artisan Cutlery slash CJRB. Um, that's going to be pretty much it today, guys. Please make sure to follow me on Instagram at Metal underscore Complex. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like. If you'd like to check out my other content, I do, of course, have lots of videos of knives. They're either expensive or inexpensive that I do or don't like, so check those out. And if you enjoy all my content, go ahead and click on that Metal Complex logo right there and subscribe because there's definitely more coming. Thanks again for watching, everybody, and have a great day.